thought I rocked a D hat today. I said it was time for me to change up hats. <laughs> uh, uh, uh. Yeah. Y'all know I can't do nothing with the damn mustache, though. Shit. Let me sip. Don't worry about what's in my cup. <laughs> I'm just playing, y'all. I'm snacking. I got me some nachos. I mean, some uh, tortilla chips. And salsa. <laughs> Had me a snack. Y'all know. Y'all remember now. I got something to say about something. Otherwise, there ain't nothing to say. Now, today is the day, the third day of rallying in downtown Detroit. Now, I had a lovely day. I went roller skating on the riverfront. It's always so beautiful and peaceful. But I said to myself when I got home, I said, self, myself said, hmm. I said, it's supposed to be another rally today, 4 o'clock, right? 4 o'clock. Self said, yep, it agreed. I said, if you damn can't beat them, you might as well join them. I mind you, I wasn't trying to beat him. I'm just throwing that out there. It's just that. I ain't marched in a minute. And carried a sign in a minute. I ain't yelled in a minute. And damn it, when you've been cooped up, and I, I, I won't allow myself to be cooped up either. Because if, if that's the case, that means I'm real depressed. And I'm probably about to die. And somebody need to come and check on me. But... This whole quarantine thing, everything, just got everything so flustered, so messed up. And even in the midst of all that, people can't even just live their life without something bad happening. So I said, all right, it's daylight. They should be all right. The police here, they've been doing good. They've been... They were real cooperative and patient. You know. Hold on, I gotta eat another chip. And my mustache. Lord. Don't talk about it. Do not talk about it. Anyway. I got out there. I went over to the precinct, the state police station. They met up there. They said what they were gonna say and they started marching. Made their way back downtown. I knew I'd be walking right so back home, I knew it. I said, all right. And it was peaceful. And everybody around me at least. Good Lord. Yo, my mustache ain't acting right. I'm going to have to work on that. And the people near me, they had on masks. I had on my mask. And I had sanitized my head a few times. Oh, Lord. <laughs> This is funny to me. Anyway, there was people peaceful so far, but the, the, the curfew is at eight o'clock. So get your asses home. Get your asses in the house or on your end or in your neighborhood. Cause I know some of them did not live in Detroit. A lot of them didn't live in the city. You know I do, because they done brought me right on back to where I'm at. Show sure did. I didn't even think they was going to loop. I thought Bates was a little too tight. But they came right on up that street, didn't they? They sure did. 
That's all right. Still here the helicopter. I pray they do right tonight. That's all I know. Am I correct? Or is it wrong information? George Floyd's mother died two years ago on the same day he was killed. Am I correct in, in that statement? Because I heard also as he was saying he couldn't breathe. I know he called out for his mother. I had to cry a little bit. I, I was like, hell no. That's fucked up. Got people on the emotional, though. I'm trying not to be too emotional, but at the same time, I'm emotional. So there you go. We are emotional beings. Shit ain't right. Shit just ain't damn right. But I'm ready to respond. I don't want to react. I want to respond. What can I do? You know? Let me know. What's up? Because the time. Time to make a change. We are the people. We can do it. <laughs> yeah, don't talk about me. Yeah, I know I can't see where for shit. I don't even know why I try. But it's time. Yep, yep. Time to make a change. We are the people. We can do it. Real talk. Yeah, well, they better act right tonight. Now go home. Now don't get don't get the officers too much fit. But if you don't, it's all good. You got to do what you got to do. I'm signifying on the friend I seen it live earlier. Ain't no real right way to protest. Ain't no real right way. You know, you got to get it out. You got to do what you got to do. All these injustices don't make no damn sense. So we gonna have to do better. For doing worse is too much. Time to start doing better. I don't wanna say too much. I don't want my video to be too long. Cause I'll get off on the soapbox. Never mind, no, never mind about what's in my cup. Don't worry about it. That's this flesh. <laughs> oh yeah, you know I was skating today. I took my harmonica. I sure did. And I would get around somebody with a dog and delivery, hit the high note to see what the dog would do. <laughs> this was my horn. I'm, I'm skating and I'm coming up behind you. I'm like, <laughs> they like, shit, people ain't moving. And, oh, shit, okay, get out of the way. I tried it on the low end. <laughs> it wasn't quite the same. I hit it on the high end a couple times. Damn mustache, fuck. And a couple dog ears is raised up. But I was really trying because I had my music playing. I was trying to catch some of the tune on the music. <laughs> I don't even know, too. I just started making sounds and just make something up. It sound like something, but at the same time, it sound like nothing at all. Anyway, I pray that the protests stay peaceful today. But I understand if somehow, some way, something don't go right. And I'm a little bit, you know, I feel some type of way like you bring the kids to these things. 
I don't know about that. I saw a couple of them. And then I saw a video that was shared. That I shared. The little girl was amazed in the face. Pepper spray. So she was distraught and panicking about that. And just, I don't think kids need to be that close. If they can't be kept safe. I think they don't need to be. They can do it differently, I think. Their voice can be heard differently. When grown folks out here marching and protesting, it might not be that, that good of an idea. If you think some shit might jump off, it might not be a good idea. If, you, if they step the police, is lined up in their right gear, it might not be a good idea to have the kids with you at the protest. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. All right, y'all. That's all I really think I got to say about something today. So, I'm going to get off this camera and, and just kick back till I got something to say about something else next time.